Hey, second graders, welcome back to another wonderful school year. I hope you've had an amazing summer break. I know I enjoy getting outside, going to the pool, some vacation time with family, and spending some time with some friends too. But of course, as you most of you know, spending most of my time with my two little boys, Luke and Henry. Well, I can't wait to see you on Wednesday and hear all about your summers as well. Now, a lot of you will be coming back to Mrs. Pasapanka's class for the second time around. And I am so excited to have you back in our classroom, but you may also notice some things that are different. We're gonna have some new friends joining us as well this year, and I can't wait for them to be included in our new classroom family, our second grade classroom family. Now I've been working in our classroom, getting things set up, some things may look the same, but you'll notice some things that may be different too. So as we get ready to come back to the classroom, I can't wait to hear about your summer vacations, what you've practiced this summer, what you've been working on, if you've been read any good books or visited any really cool places. Now, as I was cleaning up and getting things ready, one of our friends came to see me. <gasps> Remember Rashid? Now, Rashid was telling me that he went on lots of adventures this summer. He went to the beach. Is it that right? He went to back to New York City to do some more work. Remember how he had to go and be a helper there? That's right. And while he was at the beach, he met a special friend who he brought back to our classroom too. This is Gus. Everyone say hi, Gus. Now, Rashid was telling me that his new friend Gus is going to come and help us in our classroom this year. He said, we're done with that first grade learning and we're ready for second grade Gus. Now, I'm sure Gus is going to take us on a lot of reading adventures this year, just like Rashid did in first grade. So when you come to school on Wednesday, you'll have to see if you can find our new reading friend Gus in our classroom. Now, he also brought this fun book for me to read to you today, so I thought it would be a good way to get started in, on this school year, and it's called A Letter from Your Teacher on the First Day of School. The author is Shannon Olson, and it's illustrated by Sandy Sonk. A Letter from Your Teacher. Dear student, this is a little welcome note I want to share with you, but I believe all that I'm about to say because every word is true. There are a few important things I'd like you to know all throughout the school year, our relationship will grow. I can't wait to get to know you all even better this year. I cannot wait to get to know you and all the things that, that make you you. Do you play sports or like to draw? Maybe you even do Kung Fu. I'll, greet, I'll get to meet your family and hear the places you've been. I want to know your favorite subject and see what awards you may win. I promise every morning to greet you with a smile. Well, give high fives and hugs or fist bump if that's your style. I will celebrate with you when you have exciting news, like it's my dog's birthday, or I got brand new shoes. I like those shoes. Has anybody else done some back to school shopping? I'm here so you can learn a lot of science, math, and reading. I'll help you with your writing and all the skills you will be needing. But learning is not just about the schoolwork that we do. Some values that I hope you'll gain are empathy and kindness, too. You can also be respectful by listening with your ears and eyes, follow directions the first time, and take good care of your supplies. Being responsible with our things. I want you to set high goals and per persevere through any test. When it comes to working hard, I expect you'll try your best. Some days will be a challenge. You may think, I just can't do it. Even when you cannot yet, I am here to help you through it. Oh, that word yet, 
Hmm. That may be a word we use a lot in our classroom this year. I'm going to try to make you laugh and put a smile on your face. We will make learning lots of fun. This is our happy place. I'm excited that you're here day by day. I hope you'll see. I love being your teacher and you mean so much to me. Love, Mrs. Pasapanka. Now, as we gear up for another school year together, I can't wait to see what we're going to learn and what we might not know yet. That word yet is going to be important for our classroom this year because there's lots of things that we cannot do yet. But as we get through our second grade year together, we are going to learn, we're going to grow, and we're going to get to work together to master all of those things that we haven't learned yet. And I can't wait to do that with you. I look forward to seeing you all on Wednesday and seeing you with a smile on your face and getting excited for another year together. Bye, everyone.